Cameron's capital Yaoundé was the place to be for urban music fans and art lovers. The city hosted the first edition of the La Zone Festival by the Douala Art Festival Domaf. Music and eye-catching street artworks like this piece by Guy Kwekam and Curly on the facade of the French Institute in Yaoundé attracted many passing by the busy Avenue Kennedy on Saturday and Sunday. During two days, street art was put under the spotlight in this famous section of Cameroon's capital. If one can mention art in relation with the development goals for the millennium, here eccentric artists did also prepare for the future. They were creating the clothing trends of 2050. Three fashion designers joined forces to imagine what fashion could look like by the mid-21st century. We went with the flow of the Doma festival theme, which is tomorrow is yesterday. So we designed garments trying to figure out what clothing in 2050 could look like. We work with everything from wood to aluminum or kitchen utensils. We call it upcycling. You'll wonder why upcycle at all. Because clothes or objects that were created do not have the right to die. Clad in flashy colors, models were essential parts of the project and they were on the same page with the designers. Anything anyone creates should not be forgotten because it bears the image of its creator. He let his spirit work, so we have to promote his work. Shoes, fabric or even objects, nothing is lost here. Everything can be transformed. If the future is on everyone's minds, it is because the festival organizers were inspired by the UN's Sustainable Development Goals and partnered with civil society actors. The event was also highly influenced by the Abidjan market for performing arts, Massa. It is the first time that we replicate the experience of the Massa zone outside of Abidjan, so it is good that it takes place in Yaoundé, the capital, on a busy avenue, which is a lively spot in the city. Over the weekend, the public loafed around the Kennedy Avenue, discovering music genres, traditional Cameroonian dances and participating in workshops. Various actors also raised awareness on sustainable development during the festival.